Hi, this is Eric Davis from LittleStream Software. I'm going to show you how to enable OpenID authentication for Redmine and Chili projects. The first thing you need to do is to install the Ruby OpenID gem. This gem is used to process the OpenID logins for Redmine. Make sure you get at least version 2.0 of the gem. There is a 1.0 version that will not work and you'll get some funky errors. If you do happen to install the 1.0 version, and you get these errors, you can look them up on Google and it'll pretty much tell you right away that you're using an old version. Once the gym is installed, you'll need to restart Redmine and then you can enable OpenID. To turn it on, log in as an administrator and go to the Administration panel, Settings, and the Authentication tab. Here you can see the Allow OpenID option. Just check it and save. If you don't have the gym installed or if it's the older version, this option will actually be grayed out and that way you can know that you have the correct version installed. And that's it. Now new users can either enter their OpenID URL to register and log in, or they can add their OpenID URL to their account later on and start using the URL as the login instead of a username and password. That wraps up this screencast. This video is just one video in my Redmine series. If you go to theadmin.org forward slash videos, then I'll send you the entire series for free. Thanks again for watching.